Good morning. I have high hopes for Sweden these days. Uh, it's been very bad for some time, I can tell you this honestly. But uh, now the, there was this poll from Norvus and they got the Green Party at 3.8%, which is the lowest score for the Green Party from this particular poll institute. This is, according to me, the most corrupt poll institute that we have in Sweden. They are usually employed by public service TV and they always put the left uh, higher, you see. So, and the very positive thing about this poll was that the Green Party are losing a lot of young voters. The greatest loss is among younger voters. Uh, the Green Party are very much depending on young people. People who have not started working yet, they are not really part of society, you know, they haven't, maybe they haven't started to pay taxes and so on, right? So, uh, and they tend to vote for the Green Party, but now they are losing a lot of them. Maybe the young people are becoming smarter, I don't know. And I think it's because the Green Party are very, very hard to understand these days. Yes, they have these issues that they talk about a lot. Like moose, for instance. You know, these animals that walk the forests of Sweden, the big horns. Yeah. The Green Party wants to kill some of them off. Because they destroy the planet. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. When they fart. It's, you see. I'm not making this up. So, and this I think is very hard to understand. I mean, the moose are part of the planet, first of all. <laughs> and them farting, I don't understand <laughs> how this could destroy the planet. <laughs> and then they talk a lot about migration. This is a key thing for them. They want to present a very positive view on migration. They say so. And for the future, yeah. So um, they want to get back to the old rules that we had before the big migration flood that we had in 2015. Uh, they had to do something in 2015 because we were totally flooded here in Sweden in 2015. So they changed the law. So the people that came here, they didn't get a permanent permit to stay. Yeah. So now after 2015 they got a temporary permit to stay. And now the Green Party wants to get back to the old rule. Yeah, make it easier. Sweden are Sweden is still accepting a lot more refugees than any comparable nation. Yeah, you can compare it to Germany, but we are really accepting a lot of people still. And um, the Green Party wants more of them. And maybe this is hard to understand. If you live in Sweden, if you read the news, just the news, mainstream media, you will understand that this might be a problem. Yes. So, um, this is very positive. They dropping. Yeah, they are dropping. This is good. So that's the positive Sunday report. Okay, bye.